Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here. Back with another video and in this video, we're going to do a complete detailed tutorial on how to use the cover screen on the Z Flip 5. Now, do note that the video is divided into chapters. Links are in the description of the video. We will show you how to use the cover screen on the Z Flip 5 how to use the camera on the cover screen on the Z Flip 5 and then last but not the least we will also show you how to customize the cover screen on the Z Flip 5. Now the first thing I recommend you do with the cover screen on the Z Flip 5 is to download the good lock module and then enable the feature of using any app on the cover screen of the Z Flip 5. A separate detailed tutorial about that can be found in the description of the video and without any further delay let us get down to business. To wake up the cover screen on your Z Flip 5, you have to do a single tap and then you can see the time until and unless you have always on display enabled. A double tap is going to unlock it. You might have to unlock the phone using the fingerprint scanner. If you swipe from left to right, you will be able to see your notifications. And if you have customized your cover screen, we'll talk more about that later in the video, but you will also see a dot over here for notifications. Swiping from left to right is going to cycle through the different widgets which you have set up on the cover screen and in case you are wondering what is this application which is letting me run any app on the cover screen of my z flip 5 we have a separate video for that which can be found in the description of the video and if you double tap on any of the widgets you can put your cover screen to sleep now do note that the first screen which you land upon this is your home screen for the cover screen and if you swipe down you will be able to access the quick settings panel wherein you can change the brightness and unfortunately you cannot customize these options which appear on the quick settings panel and swipe up from anywhere to go to the home screen so we are back on the home screen of the cover screen on the z flip 5 and again if you're wondering how i am cycling through different images videos and gifs we have a separate video for that which again can be found in the description of the video then if you do not want to swipe through the different widgets you have a lot of widgets if you use this gesture over here to pinch in using two fingers these are all the different widgets which i have activated on the cover screen of my z flip 5 and if i tap on any of them i should be able to go and access that specific widget and again swipe up to go to the home screen Next up, let us say you want to change the clock widget. So while we are on the home screen of the cover screen, press and hold. And now you can cycle through the different clock widgets which are available for the cover screen of the Z Flip 5. And whichever one you are happy with, just tap on it and bam. Now this here is the new clock widget for the cover screen on the Z Flip 5. Next up, let us say you want the widgets to appear in a specific order. For starters, this one over here, the clock widget has to be the first widget, but the others can be rearranged from the cover screen as well. So all you need to do is you need to press and hold. And now let us say I want the calendar to be the one after the clock. So on the bottom, you again press and hold, and then you'll feel a little vibration and bam, here it is. You can now move it around and once i'm happy with the results here it is after the clock the calendar is the next widget and of course if you want to add more widgets from the cover screen all you have to do is press and hold and then cycle through towards the end here tap on the plus sign and these are the different widget options which are available to me right now which can be added to the cover screen on the z flip 5 here it is this one was added without any issues Next up, another thing you will notice on the home screen of the cover screen is this icon on the bottom, right? So right now it is set as the camera application and you can customize it inside the cover screen settings. We'll talk more about that later in the video, but how do you open whatever shortcut you have set up? So all you have to do is tap on this and then swipe diagonally and that should open the camera. And of course, the most easiest way of accessing the camera on the cover screen is to press the power button or the fingerprint button twice and you might have to unlock your device but it is going to open the camera application next up while we are in the camera on the cover screen of the z flip 5 let us see how you can use that properly so if you swipe you can switch between the different options so right now i am in portrait mode and on the bottom you have this dot you can switch between blur studio 
high kimono and a bunch of other options then the default mode would be the photo mode and then if you swipe from right towards the left hand side you can switch to the video mode so how do you take a photo all you have to do is show your palm it will detect that your palm is there and it is going to take a picture other than that you can also tap to take a picture and this thing you can customize so on the top right you see this down arrow select this and this here is the option which will turn tap screen to take a picture off and now if i tap on the screen it will not take a picture and once you have that turned off you will see this circle over here if you do not see it just tap on the screen once you will see the shutter button select this and bam we just took another picture other than that if you tap on the down arrow you can also change a bunch of other options so natural or warm then you can change the resolution do you want full 9 by 16 3 by 4 and you also have the option of motion photo enable or disable that and you can also set a timer another option i think to take a picture is if you press any of the volume rockers that should also take a picture so yes volume up volume down is also going to take a picture from the cover screen and last but not the least if you want to switch between the two lenses previously on the z flip 4 you could actually swipe down to switch between the lens but that functionality has been disabled on the z flip 5 so you have to use the pinch to zoom gesture to switch between the different lenses and here it is you can see we are right now at 0.9x you can go down to 0.5x i think and then the maximum zoom out over here is you can go up to 10x next up let us see how you can customize the cover screen after you have unflipped the z flip 4 so you will go into settings and here in you will go into cover screen this is where all the customization for the cover screen is present on the top right you see manage once you select the manage option from here in you can delete any of the clocks which you do not like so if i tap on the minus sign besides this one bam here it is that is now deleted tap on done on the top right and if if you go back to the cover screen press and hold and look for options for the clock widget that specific clock is not going to appear next up you can cycle through the different clocks over here and if you tap on any of the clocks it is going to give you options to customize that specific clock for the cover screen so let us tap on this one now on the bottom you will see different options appear so i can add a filter i can actually add more images from the gallery in case i want to and then i can also delete specific images if i tap on the clock i can change the font i can change the position of the clock and i can also change the color if i want to then if you tap on the plus sign on the top right which says battery i can enable the toggle to show the battery icon and then how do you customize the option of the shortcut on the bottom right of the cover screen well tap on the camera icon and bam here it is i can choose between camera flashlight calendar steps weather and of course no application then on the left over here in the middle you will see a small dot if you tap on that dot you can now change your notification style for the cover screen so you can choose between none a dot and if you want icons on the top left you can do that as well once you're happy with the results select done now another pro tip over here is that not all the options are going to appear for all the clocks so let us say we go and customize this one so in this one i can actually choose the frame and color of the frame i can choose between graphical and alphabet then i can also change the position of the clock and the font other than that if i go into some other clock so let us choose this one so on this one you will notice that i cannot change the color of the clock the style of the clock the only thing i can change is the pictures which are going to appear over here so again not all lock screen clocks for the cover screen have the same customization features of course if you select add new here are a bunch of different 
clocks which you can add on the cover screen so you have the featured ones then you have gallery so here and you can choose any picture gif or video then you have your informative presets along with graphicals and for this graphical one over here you can change the character as well so you can choose a frog in case you want to next up you can also customize the widgets which show up on the cover screen as an option to add them so right now we have calendar alarm launcher you can choose your recent calls a direct dial in case you want to and then you can also change the order in which they appear after the clock widget so select reorder and then to move it just press and hold and then you can move it wherever you want to you can move it up or you can move it down once you're happy with the results you can always go back then of course you can change the cover screen timeout so you have 5 seconds 10 seconds 15 seconds and 30 seconds if you want to enable notifications you have a toggle for that turn on screen for notifications another toggle for that next up we have quick responses so if you want you can actually use the messages app on the cover screen now do note the keyboard here is going to default to the samsung keyboard but you can customize your quick responses as well for the cover screen on the z flip 5 and there it is peeps that was our full detailed cover screen tutorial for the z flip 5 showing you how to use the cover screen how to use the camera on the cover screen and of course how to customize the cover screen on the Z Flip 5.